So today we're going to do uh, text editing in graphs in MATLAB. The first thing that we're going to do is add an X data uh, set of data. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we're going to set up two Y data sets. The first Y data set is going to be uh, the first set of vertical information. There we go. Then we're going to have another set of Y data. And here we go. Um, from there, we're going to plot the two sets of data uh, with the common X data. So we're going to say figure one. Right, so figure one has appeared like that. I'm going to put in the plot um, command. The plot command says that I want to plot x data versus y data one, and then x data versus y data two. X data and y data one are separated by commas, and then we separate out by another comma and another comma there. I hit enter. I switch over to the plot, and here you go. You can see the plot right here. We have one set of data that is uh, colored in blue, right there, and another set of data that is colored in red. And we have to figure out ways of distinguishing between those two. Um, but the first thing we're going to do is type in what the title of the plot is, my two voltage measurements, or measurement sets. Then we're going to put in um, what the Y label or vertical axis is. We're going to say um, Y label voltage and in units we have volts for units. X label is going to be in time in seconds. Change that, I made a mistake, like that. Uh, and then I'm going to add in something called a legend. And the legend will appear as a box on the figure that tells me what the red and blue lines are. So I'll type in legend, like that. And then uh, my first measurement set, measurement set one, like that. And then my next one will be measurement set two. Um, and there we go. So now I'm going to switch over to the graph. And there we have it. So we have the title, my two voltage measurement sets, my Y label, voltage in volts, my X label in seconds, and my legend right there. Now the next thing I'm going to do is add text to an arbitrary point inside of the graph itself. So to do that, um, I will type in text, open parenthesis, and I'm pausing, and MATLAB realizes that I've paused, and maybe it's, it knows that I'm doubtful about what to put in next, so it gives me some help as to potentially what could be filled in there. And we see that it says text x comma y comma str, which means x position or horizontal position, y position uh, or vertical position, and str means string. And string means effectively a bunch of uh, letters and numbers that would be displayed on the screen. So I'm going to type in uh, an x value of 6 and a y value of 20. And my string will be, this is a very cool string right there. Close the parenthesis, semicolon, enter, and let's take a look at the graph. There we go. So as we see it right here, that string that I typed in has appeared and it starts with an X position of six and a vertical position of 20, just like that.